Last year, Coach David Ming received national recognition with the Game Changer Award. The plaque now hangs in his batting cages. Last month, he was named head coach at Palo Verde High School. Now, the district has severed all ties with him, causing an uproar among his supporters. It's unfortunate, for sure. Coach David Ming can no longer volunteer at Palo Verde High, with a baseball team he's led for a decade. <laughs> From his batting cages in North Las Vegas, he's left wondering why his volunteer badge was pulled by district officials just weeks after he was named head coach. Here I am a month later, after 10 years of volunteering my time and giving back to these kids, where I just can't even get a, a response. In fact, the only response that I received was that uh, it's in CCSD's best interest uh, to, to, to move forward in the decision stance. Ming's attorneys sent a letter to CCSD demanding answers as the coach has cataloged two years worth of accusations against him that he gave to 13 Action News. Claims from anonymous, now largely inactive social media accounts to anonymous emails sent to his school claiming he's abused children and mishandled donations for his own use. Unequivocally false and I have two years documentations that was brought to CCSD multiple times. Quite frankly, I, I've never had a traffic ticket in, in 10 years. His assistant coaches and parents of kids he's coached have rallied to his defense. It's frightening to think that something like that can happen in this day and age, anonymous. You know, I've been coaching in this town for 35 years. Um, seen a lot of coaches in this town and I've coached with a lot of coaches and I've never coached with anybody finer than Coach Main. It's just awful what's happened. Greg really? Jeffries played in the majors and still has his kids involved in Ming's club team. He's a teacher. And that's why I'm still with him. I'm still here. Because if I believed in any of this, I wouldn't be here. My kids are still in this program. CCSD officials said they couldn't comment on personnel issues or pending litigation, but pointed us to their volunteer policy, which states if any volunteer breaks any of the regulations in this 10-page document, they can be terminated and removed from all school contact immediately. I'm fighting at this point for the next volunteer. Ming says he would like for the district to install an investigation clause, giving volunteers a chance to appeal before termination. They're not protected. They're, they're a sitting duck for the first anonymous email. Ming says he is now shifting his focus away from CCSD to bringing the national club organization USA Prime Baseball to Nevada for the first time. In North Las Vegas, I'm Sean Delancey.